Hey everyone, it's Dina, and I'm going to do a quick uh, video of Ghost. He is a year old. Hey baby, come here. Let's see if I can show you him. Uh, you probably saw him in the last video, but this is my baby. Uh, he's a Great Dane. He is a uh, Moreliquin. Uh, it's kind of like a Harlequin. He's light marked, very light marked. Um, but, and he just got in the bathtub. Ghost, come here. <laughs> Ghost. Anyway, he usually doesn't like baths, so it's really funny that he actually got in there. I think it's because I closed the door, and I usually have to kind of fight him to get in the bathtub, so he thinks he's getting a bath, so he's being a good boy. Anyway, so he's a Moreliquin, a light-marked Moreliquin, and it's kind of like a Harlequin, but he's a chocolate, so it's very rare. You've probably seen those other previous videos of him, but he turned a year old October the 19th. And he, uh, let's see, the day after his birthday, he weighed 104 pounds. He is about, come here, baby. Come here, let me see if I can back up. Uh, he is about 104 pounds. He's probably about 110 or 115 pounds, and I think he's about to sit on me, baby. And yeah, um, he's really, he's a big, big baby. Oh my gosh. He's a big boy. The big babies. But anyway, oh, I love him. Um, what to say, what to say, ghost? What are we going to talk about, huh? <laughs> uh, I will definitely say that the bigger he has gotten, the more trouble he can be. Poor baby. He actually ran through the house um, a couple weeks ago and put two dents in our wall. So uh, I've had to patch those up. And um, yeah, I'm kind of handy when it comes to painting, obviously. I'm crafty, so I can do that. So that's not a problem, but I will, he's ringing the bell. He's trying to ring the, the door. He keeps taking his nose over to the door, to the doorknob. It's so cute. But um, with 104 pounds, yeah, he can knock you over. Quit. And um, when he leans on you, it's because he loves you. Um, that's what I've always read. So that's a good thing, I guess, if he does. You can still see his cute little heart. Cute. <clears throat> but um, I would never recommend a Great Dane for small, with, with a family for small children. Uh, I definitely have learned that. Um, he's even, he's had some spells with swallowing socks and has had to have surgery, unfortunately. Um, we were not here at the time. He was on, we were on vacation and um, came back and he had a stomach ache and we couldn't figure out what was wrong. So we figured he must have swallowed something but we didn't think it was a sock, so yeah. So he got those stuck, he swallowed a few. And uh, so since he already was, um, he had not been fixed yet and uh, with Great Danes we wanted to get him gastropexy. So anyway, because that kind of protects him of um, dying of bloat, so and that's just twisting of the belly. So uh, they go in and um, pexy his stomach. Oh, baby. <laughs> so um, yeah, but he's a year old, and you know we went through a little bit of a time there. So he's definitely he's too big for families with small children. Mm -hmm. Um, even my six-year-old Zoe, she tends to get knocked over. He has literally, oh, okay. He has literally uh, jumped and knocked her down at least twice, where she'll raise a toy up to get it away from him, and it's one of her toys. She raises it up, and he jumps up and lands, literally smacks her down on the ground. So he has done that twice, so he's definitely not recommended for small children or even, like I said, she's six and she's a tall six-year-old, um, or elderly. Definitely a no, no, no. Um, I was recently, uh, my vet recently, uh, since I had owned him, owned a Great Dane, a large one, she had recently um, told me to call one of their, uh, their customers or whatever you want to say because they were thinking about it getting a Great Dane. What? Did you eat something? Oh, you're so see. He eats things. He just licks the floor and eats something. And I didn't see anything on the ground, so I don't even know what he's eating. He might not be eating anything. He's probably just fixing his lips. Oh, he's shaking. The good boys, yes you are. So yeah, I don't want this video to be too long, but he is still my big baby. And um, yeah. 
If you all have any questions, definitely uh, feel free to ask because I think Great Danes are really awesome dogs. He has a fantastic personality. Oh, I see it's a hair. He's got a hair in his mouth. <laughs> I was wondering what you were doing. Yes, I was. Yes, I was. But he's just such a good baby. They're good boys. Thank you. Yeah. And he's not much of a licker, so I love it when he does give me kisses, Joe. That's a good boy. All right. Um, yeah, me and Ghosty Boo. We'll see you all later. And yeah, say bye, Ghosty Boo. Say bye, baby. I love you so much. Oh, bye.